Yeah, but one minute it's Jay, the next minute it's some random guy from Spain. I mean, does he think we're stupid? Hey, he does funny things to people and knock on the head. Oh, yeah, as if he didn't know he was trying to beat him to death. He made a mistake. Easily done. The main thing is, he's put it right. No, the main thing is, is that someone's getting away with putting him in hospital. Then that's up to Kane to sort out. OK, so his story might have more holes in it than a colander, but if it stops us ripping chunks out of each other, it works for me. As far as we're concerned, it's case closed. It's time to let it lie, love. See, the trouble with you, lad, is that you think too much. So why else would he change his story overnight? Because he remembered what happened, simple. Yeah, after talking to you. Well, someone must have jogged his memory. Or someone. You talked him into it, didn't you? What I say to my son is my business. So someone's going to get away with this, then? Kane's word is good enough for me and it should be good enough for you. Now, come on. Get yourself back to work and forget about it. All right. He heard your news. Must be dead relieved. Well, yeah, relieved enough to order a bottle of your finest with two glasses now, please. Well, that'll be on me. No need. Every need. I got it wrong and I'm, I'm sorry. You all did. I'd have done the same if my brother was in hospital. And I take it your apology extends over here to me? Yeah. Even though you did leave him dying in the gutter. Oh, yeah. Well, I won't next time. Throw money at him so he'd lie for you, did you? Aaron, you're what a you flaming rock now. You're out of control, One way or another, you're going to pay for what you've done to him. But you're going to do nothing till you've talked to me. Now, come on, back room. We know your mouth, no action. Remember who you're talking to? Why should I? You're sitting here and drink with this piece of scum. Our bell's got more balls than you have. Look, am I going to have to push you? Come on, back room! Babe, you are right. Yeah, fine, thanks. Like a dog with a flaming bone. I wonder if you can talk some sense into him, it's Zach. Ian! Look, look, will you trust me? It's always a mistake to take the law into your own hands. So what, we stand back like a bunch of girls and let him get away with it? He's not getting away with anything! He didn't do it, even the police said. What, and you believe it, do you? Yeah, and so should you. With a past like our Kane's, it'd be a miracle if no-one was after him. No, Kane is better than this. He deserves more, especially from you. Our Kane has always got what he deserved from me. But there's been so much trouble, so much hurt in this family. It's got to stop here. Yeah, well, you might have given up on him, but I certainly haven't. And believe me, I will do more than smash a few windows this time. Do as I say! Look, listen to me. I'm telling you, no. I am ordering you to keep your hands to yourself and your mouth shut. And what are you going to do to stop me? Hmm? Hey? You're supposed to be the head of this family. You're nothing but a sad old man. If you so much as blink at him out there, I am warning you, I will lay you out! Like a lady, I can out. You are? You heard. You wanted an answer, didn't you? Well, now you've got one. His blood's on my hands. No one else's. He broke so many lives. Amy's. My grandson that she gave away. Morris family. Jay's family. It was like nothing mattered to him anymore. So you thought you'd show him what did matter? He played with people and then broke them. There's nothing here where his heart should be. You're wrong. You are, you're wrong. When I needed someone, when Jackson died, he didn't let me down. He loves Debbie and Sarah. And he loves charity deep down. Now, the family is no choice. But anyone else, anyone who crosses him, he's got so much bile. He... First thing he does when he wakes up in that hospital bed is work out a way to break Charity's heart by fitting up her fella. All this time? All that stuff about family coming before everything. It's all lies. This is gonna kill Debbie, you know. 
She loves you, they all do. Me and Lisa can live with it, and charity in her fella. But Debbie is the apple of her dad's eye. She's not to know, not ever. To save your sorry backside, I don't think so. Look, if so much as a hint of this passes your lips to her, you'll find out how much Cain really cares about you. You scum. That's what you are. <laughs>